Hello everybody, and today I am here um, with the upcoming mod, Equivalent Exchange 3. So right now it's in pre-1F stage, I believe, and not many functions have been added yet, but I'm just going to go over, so far, what is here. So the first thing you want to do is you want to craft something called an inert stone. And an inert stone is crafted by taking four stone, oops, uh, four iron, and one gold, and putting them in this pattern, and you get your, then you get yourself an inert stone. Now, an inert stone doesn't really do anything right now. Throw it, play baseball with it, I guess. But um, after you craft yourself one of these, you want to go kill some hostile mobs and hope that they'll drop a shard of minium. Minium, yeah. So um, what what minium will do is it'll allow you to create a minium stone. This thing by doing this. And, like I said before, the way to get these is to kill hostile mobs and hope that they drop some. At least that's, I believe, how they're, they're found. But, um, anyway, so, craft your minium stone, you take your eight shards of minium, and then you get yourself your, your inert stone, and you put it in the center, and then you'll get yourself one minium stone. Now, with a minium stone, it kind of works like, um, the philosopher's stone does. And I really like this because, like, the tile that you're looking at kind of glows. It's pretty cool. And if you look at the bottom right-hand corner, you can see that there's a little grass block floating, like, right here. And, um, what you can do is if you press G, it'll change. And if you right-click on something, it'll play a little sound. and it will transform whatever block you're looking at into what is in the bottom right hand corner. And so far, it's cobblestone, grass, sand, and dirt. That's nifty. And now, he's, uh, Pahamar has also added these things called alchemical bags, which don't seem to do anything right now. But I'm guessing they're going to be like the other alchemical bags in the old EE. And the Philosopher's Stone is also still here, but there's no crafting recipe yet. And what it does... Oh, r one real quick thing. With the Minium Stone, and you can also do this f with the Philosopher's Stone, if you press C, it'll open up a little crafting grid. So I can go ahead and craft myself some, like, baked potatoes or something. Even though that's a furnace recipe. But, um, the Philosopher's Stone also has that function. By pressing C, you can open this little crafting table right here. And the Philosopher's Stone, as you can see in the bottom right-hand corner, also has the, uh, the, little, the little thingy that pops up and tells you, oh, I'm going to transform this into whatever block that is right there. But now this time you can also charge this up, as you might have heard that. And by pressing V, it will charge the, um, charge the stone. And it will change its uh, its the dimensions that it creates the stuff in. So now you can see it's much larger. I wouldn't say radius, but a much larger area. Um, there is also a calcinator, but um, from what I've seen so far, is that all it does is eat your items. Yeah, not much really happens. But this will probably do something cool in the next update, most likely, which, yeah, most likely. You can't even put, like, coal down there. Oop, not that. Nope, just goes away. And now, there's also red water. I have not found this in the, in the wild, you could say. I haven't found it in the wild yet. But it looks important. And probably has to do something with the calcinator, maybe. If you get a bucket of red water, you can boil it into different stuff, or... I don't know. I want to see if it hurts you. No. I wonder if you can pick it up in a bucket. I'm afraid that'll crash the game, though. Oh, you get water. Okay. Well, this is just a real quick update. Not really update, but a real quick... Um, overview on what this mod is so far 
and it seems pretty interesting. Pahamar's doing a good job of keeping EE alive, and I can't wait to see what this is when it's finished. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you some other time.